In 2019, there were 179 stillbirths and neonatal deaths in Northern Ireland. One of those was my daughter Ellie. Three months after we got married, I found out I was expecting our first baby. We were delighted. They would be the first grandchild on both sides of our family and everyone was so excited. My pregnancy went well. I had quite a bit of morning sickness, but our baby was healthy and thriving, so that was all that mattered. We didn't find out our baby's gender, which just added to the excitement everyone guessing if they would be a boy or a girl. We were so ready to welcome our little one into our lives. However, at 38 weeks pregnant on Monday the 5th of August at 20 past 9, I gave birth to our beautiful baby daughter. We named her Ellie Grace Dyer. She was eight pounds four with thick wavy black hair. She was beautiful, but she was silent. Our little girl was born asleep. We spent the next two days making memories with her. We bathed her, dressed her, took photos and held her tight. Leaving the hospital without our baby was the most painful experience. We were heartbroken. The silence in our house was deafening, her nursery empty and all of her clothes that had been washed and ironed would never be worn. We live with the pain and heartbreak of losing Ellie every day, but we will never stop speaking of our daughter. We need to break the silence by speaking about our babies and raising awareness regarding baby loss to break the stigma and to help future families with the heartbreak of losing their baby. Grief is like the ocean. Sometimes the water is calm and sometimes it is overwhelming, but all we can do is learn to swim.